and machines capture not only the sky, but also the waters of the seas. We are talking about controlled underwater drones, which are preparing to take their baptism of fire in the Russian-Ukrainian war. What can these underwater drones do and how will their use help Ukraine? Now you will learn everything. Just a few months ago, even before the start of the full-scale Russian invasion of Ukraine, DARPA signed contracts under the Manta Ray program. Northrop Grumman Systems Corporation and Martin Defense Group are involved in the development and production. Each of these companies must create and manufacture their own version of the Manta Ray underwater drone. Since then, nine months have passed. Obviously, the new Manta Ray drones are undergoing successful tests, so the navies of some NATO countries are ready to give Ukraine models of the previous generation. The British Navy was the first to respond, handing over six Remus underwater drones to Ukraine. The UK Ministry of Defence, MOD, has announced plans to donate mine hunting autonomous underwater vehicles, OVs, to Ukraine to help the country clear its coastline of Russian mines. Ahead of delivery, Ukrainian personnel are also being trained to operate the systems, the MOD said. Since the United Nations brokered a deal with Russia and Ukraine in July to enable commercial ships to safely export foodstuffs from Ukraine through the Black Sea, a small number of ships carrying grain have left Ukraine. However, the effort continues to be hampered by sea mines laid by Russian forces along Ukraine's coast. To support Ukraine's efforts to conduct mine clearance of its waterways, the MOD said six OVs will be donated for mine detection, including three that will be provided from UK stocks and three that will be purchased from industry. The MOD has declined to name the type of OVs being donated, but said all six will be of the same type, and capable of operating effectively in shallow water environments at depths of up to 100 meters to detect, locate, and identify mines. Meanwhile, the RN is also training Ukrainian sailors to operate Sandown-class minehunter vessels. Ukraine was scheduled to receive two former RN Sandown-class minehunters, XHMS Ramsey and XHMS 